Uh, my name is uh, Marcus. In a band called the No Twist. I am David. I am uh, from Berkeley, California. Uh, I go by Odd No Stone. I'm part of Anticon Records. We are at Amoeba in a, a Hollywood discussing our. Uh, yeah, feeding each other with uh, music and records. I choose this one for uh, Mr. Nostan because I think it's the best, one of the best jazz records I know. So with by Charlie Mingus and he's playing piano on this one and singing, really raw, very energetic, very intense record and very, you know, bluesy in a, in a very good way. So it's like one of my favorite records ever. So I, I, I return to this one very often. So. That's why I thought you should know it. So. Yeah, and I have this record. Uh, yeah, uh, We the People. They're a Texas band, and this is a compilation of rec uh, songs they recorded in 1966. And I have another compilation of theirs that's the sequence of it isn't very good. It's not the most listenable record all the way through, and then this just came out. And I think it's an amazing sequence of, of their songs. You can listen to the whole album. This is a, a group called Belong. They're from New Orleans. Uh, they're friends of mine. And they did a, this is a really limited uh, vinyl only EP. And they do covers of a, they do a Sid Barrett cover, um, Tin Turn Abbey cover, and a Billy Nichols cover. And there's a cover of another, there's four songs and they're done really ambient, kind of My Bloody Valentine uh, covers where it, you almost can't really even hear the song. You gotta like kind of listen to it a lot to discover the song. Um, but I'm a huge fan of music like that, and, and I believe that Marcus yeah, will really yeah, enjoy I, it. I heard it once and liked it very, very much. So um, David asked me for like more groovy jazz stuff, so I gave him this record because it's Ethiopian jazz, you know. So and I think that's. The, yeah, that, that's music I listen to very often, and I like it very much. It's this kind of has this oriental feeling to it, so it became very popular with this last Jim Chalmers. Aiden Baker and Tim Hecker, also from the unusually experimental section. But uh, Tim, uh, Aiden Baker's in a band called Naja, and uh, they did a, this collaboration, and it's heavy ambient soundscape type of type of stuff, moody. I'm a, I'm a huge fan of Tim Hecker and Nadja, and I'm very excited to, to now own this record. And then I bought this for a friend. He said, uh, if I go to Los Angeles, I have to buy these CDs for him. It's by a guy from Los Angeles called Gaslamp Killer. Oh. And he, made, he makes this mix that my friend likes a lot, but I will listen to them too, So, because I'm sure I like it too. It's, he said it's great, and I trust him. So. And then Fapo, Fap Pardokli? You know how to pronounce this? Yeah, no, right. no, I have no idea. This is a reissue of a rare record by a guy named Meryl Fink Hauser. I've only heard the first song, Lila, but it's great. Is that one that we picked for you, or did you pick for yourself? This is one that we were, we've been discussing. One, yeah, yeah, but yeah, we, we bought it both. We, we don't have it, so, so we have to buy it. Every one of us. Do you guys usually pick each other's records out, or is this, uh, you go to other stores and do this kind of thing? Or you know, it's a, for me it's a chance to, you know, it's really good to go shopping with him because uh, normally, you know, you always look at the same artists and stuff. Mm -hmm. And he has really a lot of knowledge about things that I don't know. So, so it's, I just tell him, you know, everything he likes should give to me and that, that he thinks that I could like too. So I will just buy it, you know, because so, I'm I sure that I like it. Yeah.